Okay, I'm gonna show you how to make a really quick, sort of almost like a steak fry on the grill, but using sweet potatoes. We have our sweet potatoes that we parboiled, so they're really soft all the way through. I call this backyard cheating, right? You wanna par cook them, this way you're gonna guarantee yourself a nice tender sweet potato, and then we're gonna put them on the grill for all that smoky flavor. Cut them in nice big wedge, this way you'll have a better chance of them not falling through the grates. If you lose one or two, that's part of grilling, it's part of the barbecue, it's okay. So just gonna brush this with a little bit of canola oil, just a tiny bit so it doesn't stick to the grill. Some salt and pepper. Now when I set up my grill, I like to use a combination of charcoal briquettes and also some hardwood charcoal. I like to have a hot part of the grill and then another part where there's no charcoal. All right, we have our sweet potatoes. We're gonna put these on the hot part of the grill. We don't want these to cook slowly. We actually want them to cook kind of quickly because remember, they're already par cooked and I just want a nice crust on the outside. It's really important to just let the grill do its job at this point. You want them to get nice and crusty. If you keep moving them around, you're not gonna achieve any color at all. And they'll probably stick to the grill. So we're just gonna let them cook on one side. And while that's happening, we're gonna throw together our very quick dipping sauce. It's just a couple of ingredients, so let's make it happen. Some Dijon mustard, some whole grain mustard. I'm gonna grab some honey. Honey and mustard, great combination. Goes fantastic with sweet potatoes. Dijon mustard has got a nice spicy flavor to it and it's nice and smooth. The whole grain mustard, also spicy, but it's got those mustard seeds running through it so it gives it a little bit of crunch. A little salt and pepper. I can hear my sweet potatoes grilling away. These, these are ridiculous, but I have to use them. Baby whisk. These are beautiful. All right, and then some fresh mint. Let's grab our sweet potatoes. If one or two of them get, get a little charred, you know, that's okay. They're not all gonna be perfect. That one's perfect. Sweet potatoes, take some of our dipping sauce. That's the key. It's all about making it so easy for yourself. If you have the sweet potatoes part cooked, you have a dipping sauce ready to go, three ingredients, and we have sweet potato fries. That simple.